So the retainer's in place, but is it focused on marketing activity or is it focused on a, a goal, an output like um, leads, for example? Uh, and we see both scenarios uh, and we tend to encourage people towards one of these two scenarios and there's a reason why. So let's explore this then, this idea of being focused not on leads, but on activity. What's, what, is, what does it look like? How would we know if this is happening? I think you'll know if it's happening if um, every month you've got a list, a massive list of things that are happening, whether, you know, and it's probably across a number of different like uh, responsibilities um, or activities, f f like um, you know, image editing, social media, content writing, um, you know, blogs, you know, direct mail. It might also span into a non-digital work as well. So all this, all this work is happening, but then what, what does it mean? So you're investing your three or four grand a month with your uh, agency, but what, what's the return on investment? What's the value that you're getting back from the agency? So really you'll know if you're in this situation because the results won't be, in, won't be reported on at the front of yeah. the, uh, the meetings. Big indicator, isn't it? Sometimes we would meet with um, a prospective client or a new client and we would ask them about what is the goal for yeah, leads, yeah. you know, what's the number of leads do we need every month? Um, and they've never considered that question before. They've had a retainer with somebody for three years, four years, and they've never thought about what should the output be and are we getting the output that we're uh, actually looking for. Yeah, which is weird because they'll have, as a business, they'll have a sales target. Yeah. But then it, often it just gets, for some reason, it's just not been allocated. Some of that hasn't been allocated to marketing to say, right, well, What's the what's the ROI going to be? Yeah, yeah. For that activity and that um, that supplier relationship. Yeah. Okay. So if we simplify or pull this together, then we've got something where we should be leading first with the goal in our retainer, the output. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it should work that way, the same as the like a business plan would. We can think a business plan should get us to this place, grow us, or deliver this amount of sales, and we expect the business plan to. Yeah. The digital marketing plan should as well mm. and the other one is if we're considering success is that we feel busy and we can see a big list of tasks then probably something's wrong should be focused on a number yeah yeah, yeah. that's right good good interesting mm.